Hello there, Virgo. How are you doing, sweetheart? It is your girl, Jalissa, and I'm here to give you your love reading today. Happy Valentine's Day. Bless. Please like, share, comment, subscribe. Follow me wherever you found me. Thank you so much. Bless. I feel like I'm shining. All right, so Virgo, you're going to be shining. I feel like that's a message for sure. All right, so let's get it. Let's go. Holy Spirit, please come through and help me channel this message here today for Virgo. Thank you. I'm hearing good energy. All right, so I see you shining and I see good energy for you, Virgo. Confirmation on my phone. All right, so good energy. You're going to be shining. You're going to be high vibing, okay? I'm getting your vibration heightening, your vibe heightening. Let's get it. That's what's up. All right, so what's coming in for love for Virgo? Thank you. What Virgo need to know? Good energy. I just keep hearing it. Good energy. We have retreat, okay? So retreat. I see you disconnecting from the world. Religious factors, okay? Your love life is influenced by your religious upbringing and spiritual path. We have wedding, all right? So this situation involves marriage. Are you retreating? We have soulmate. Mm. I need a little bit more because actually yours is very interesting. So I do get you retreating from the world, like you're taking a time out for self. And then I see you like like manifesting attracting a soulmate yes this is your soulmate coming in this situation may involve marriage all right so either you're retreating from a, a commitment or a marriage to be with your soulmate or this is your soulmate that's retreating from a marriage or a commitment let's see talk to me spirit what's coming in for virgo you're the only sign that's giving me a little work right here okay okay whatever let's get it let's go what does Virgo need to hear? You're meant to do something. You're meant to be with someone. We have the mule. Someone is extremely stubborn and unwilling to change. I see you retreating from somebody. So you may have been in a commitment or you may be in a commitment or a marriage. I see you retreating from somebody, somebody that wanted to have control over you or have you on a leash or wrapped around their finger in one way or another. I'm sorry if that's triggering, triggering, but that's what I'm seeing. We have here the bird flying. All right, so good news is coming. News is on the way is what I'm getting. Someone's unwilling to change. Someone is stubborn. So I see you releasing them. I see you retreating from them. Keys, that's, that's good. I see new doors opening for you. Successful outcome to your problems. Yeah, so you needed to retreat from a situation from someone that is stubborn and someone that's unwilling to change in order to open up new doors i see you having success yeah the sunshine sunshine i'm gonna call you my baby boy you can call me your baby girl okay um new creative ideas new ventures a fresh new start you're opening the doors to a fresh new start a new creative venture the ram all right you could be dealing with an aries or um doesn't have to be, but I'm getting Aries. I'm getting somebody stubborn. They're also like very aggressive or something like that. Ten card. You're celebrating this release. It's like you're celebrating a divorce. You're, whoa, that's a big ass bird. What is that? A duck? It was like a duck. It just flew past my window to the lake. I have like a lake in my backyard. Um, yeah, so maybe they're a big ass bird. <laughs> All right. Where I'm from, we call birds like um, people that are for the streets. We call them birds. All right, so they could be a big bird, like Sesame Street, all right? They for the streets, okay? I see you celebrating a retreat. You're celebrating getting away from this person that you were once or you are committed to. We have bread. This brings you prosperity. This brings you more money. A period of prosperity and abundance. You celebrating, honey. You opening up some doors. <laughs> Point blank period. Let's tap in, all right? You opening up some doors, and it starts with a release. Like, it starts with you stepping away from a connection, a connection that, that could have involved someone that was married or a connection that could have involved you being committed to this person. Yeah, someone is extremely stubborn. It's coming out here multiple times and they're not willing to change. 
So I see you like looking at the horizon, like, you know what? This person just isn't going to change. I've given this person chance after chance. They're not going to change. So you know what? I'm going to change. And as you do that, doors open up for you. So I see doors opening up. I see a fresh new start for you. I see you celebrating. I see news coming in for you. There's news on the way. All right. So you're going to find out something. You're calling in your soulmate. You're meant to be with a soulmate. So I'm getting this person was in the way of that anyway. All right. Talk to me, Spirit. What else does Virgo need to hear? What else does Virgo need to hear? Judgment. Somebody's being called out. I don't know. And I'm hearing flip-flop if needed for my cross watchers. Okay. If, if you feel this is you, flip it. Okay. Take it how it goes. But I'm reading for Virgo right now. Um, you may have Virgo in your chart, but I'm getting somebody being called out. Do, 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 do. All right. Judgment is being passed. Um, I'm getting like, this is a rebirth for you. Like, this is like a moment in life. I'm hearing the knife. Na, 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 na. I'm getting, give me everything you got. For all we know, might not see tomorrow. Let's do it tonight. Dun, 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 All right, so you're like, listen, I don't even know if I got tomorrow. So I'm about to enjoy today. I'm about to do me confirmation on my phone. From heads up. I don't even know what that is. All right. So you're getting a heads up. You're having a rebirth is what I'm getting, boo-boo. The hierophant. Yeah, you're doing what's best for you. God is in the building. All right. I feel like God is calling somebody out here. And as above, so below. All right. What goes up must come down. So I'm getting somebody being called out. Whoever this stubborn person is, they're being called out. The world. We have three major arcanas here. Major Arcana after Major Arcana. So if you know anything about tarot or if you don't, Major Arcana are major um, changes, major moments, major events in our lives. Minor Arcanas are day-to-day -day experiences. You have three Major Arcanas here. You are being rebirthed, and I'm getting God literally having his hand over your life, source, the universe, and you're going through a portal. You are creating a new world to be. And I see you celebrating. You're going to celebrate this new world. You're completing a cycle. You're completing something. All right? That's it. Lesson done. Thank you. I graduated. Where's my cap and gown? Where's my cap and gown? All right? You're graduating from a lesson that the universe sent you. Page of Swords. Yup. You understood the assignment. You understood the assignment. And now somebody is going to be watching you heavily. <laughs> Clarify this judgment. We have the two of swords. Some Somebody didn't see this coming. You probably didn't even see this coming. All right? Somebody did not see this coming. You probably didn't see it coming either. The empress. Regardless of sex, female or male, I do energy. Ooh, what about the empress? Hold up. The empress births. The ten of wands. Okay. I'm getting um a little girl being significant. Uh-huh. This is going to be for somebody, not everybody, because it's very specific. But somebody is about to be called out over a pregnancy or called out over a child or something like that. Yeah, somebody's being called out. They don't see it coming. We have the Seven of Pentacles. The Moon. The Ten of Pentacles. I'm getting you investing in something quietly, secretly. You're investing in some sort of organization, goal. You're investing in something as far as your endeavors and goals go, but quietly. And I see you gaining big, big money. But you're doing it quietly. Like you're auditioning for something or you're doing something new. And so you're waiting for something to like, like pop off. It is, is what I'm getting. It will. The lovers. You have new love coming in. Mm-hmm. You're wrapping something old up and something new is coming once you're ready, once you're healed. And this is an abundant relationship. I feel like you're meeting this person via work or because of work or through work, something like that. Yeah. Um, we have temperance. This is the earth angel. You're an earth angel. Okay. I'm getting you're gaining your wings. Be patient. This is a, this is a, right now it's all about patience. All right. Having patience and having faith in the future point blank period whoa 
We have the flamingo. Embrace the in-between. You're in-between worlds. Your world's changing. Plus, love it.